Principal Williams, Stephen students of St. John's School, fellow chaplains, esteemed guests, parents, and grade six graduates, good morning. I feel very privileged to be here today among the pupils and staff of my old school to share a few words of encouragement. Today is the day that the Lord has made it. Let us be glad and rejoice in it. To the graduating class, today is also the day to say goodbye to the ringing bells, the uniform, and the daily routine of St. John's School. This part of your life is over. You are not little children anymore. You are taller, stronger, and wiser than you were when you first came here seven years ago. And from here, you will move on to bigger and better things. In the next school year, you might just be moving up the hill to PSS, or to a high school somewhere else, or to a place out of Dominica. But wherever you go, we, your parents, your teachers, and your friends, only expect one thing from you. And that one thing we expect from you is staring you in the face right now. Aspire today, inspire tomorrow. Now you may ask, what does that mean? Well, as Mrs. Lama said, to aspire means to reach for your goals or to want to do something, to be something. While inspire means to make someone else aspire. But what is it that you aspire for? What is it that you want to be or do with your life? If you want to be a doctor or a teacher or a lawyer, my advice to you is just to do your best. If you want to be a doctor, then you should give your best. If you want to be a teacher, then be the best teacher you can be. And if you want to be a lawyer or a businessman or businesswoman, then you must do your best every single day. Now you can ask yourself, but how will I know if I'm giving my best? Well, there's only three things you have to do. The first thing is, you have to start now. It doesn't say aspire someday. It says aspire today. You cannot do your best if you're wasting time. You have to start preparing for whatever it is you aspire to be from right now. Number two, self-discipline. That means spending time studying and committing yourself to attending and behaving at school. And number three, persevere. Because in life, there, was, there will always be something to get in your way. My advice to you is not to give up. Work hard and keep on working. Pray, take advice, and then work some more until you succeed. If you do your best, you will succeed. And when other people look at you and what you have done, they will be inspired to do the same. That is giving your best. Now if you permit me, I'd like to add something to your theme. Instead of aspire today, inspire tomorrow, you could say aspire, perspire, inspire, retire. <laughs> Aspire. You choose your goal. You know what you want and who you want to be. Then you perspire, you work hard, you sweat, and you don't stop until you get what you want. Then you inspire because when people see your determination, your hard work, and your success, of course they will want to do the same. And once you have done all of those, you can retire, sit back, relax. I enjoy your success. I say thank you to Sister Alces and the staff for inviting me here. And to the pupils who graduated, I say congratulations and good luck to each and every one of you. Aspire today, inspire tomorrow. Follow a good example and then be a good example.